Hey everybody, Nicola here, Lightworker, ascending up into the universe and beyond, um, assisting you on your journey and I do hope that you enjoy my video content. If so, please like and subscribe. Check out all my details below. This is the third video to a playlist of grid work for yourselves as light workers. The first video I was talking about you as a pin in the pin cushion on looking at where you are drawn to go to. The second video, which was this, was actually looking at dark portals, negative portals that are anchoring in um, grid works of a lower density. So check out the playlist also that I have for you, which is the um, distorted field video. So um, I'll put a link to that hopefully somewhere in the cards. If not, just look at my playlist that'll be on there. Okay. Yeah. So we know then that when we looked at that second video, which is about you might be feeling that you want to walk around in a, a turning right direction, but to reverse the portal, we set our intentions, we anchor our energy into the field and we then allow the energy with our intention to reverse. So we are guided through the process. There is a mission within it. It's a divine mission that breadcrumbs you to that location. Okay, let's move on from there, please. Da. Da. Ala kianto da bari mi kosha makiato, da ba kosha makiato. Ila kianto da bahu ni mo kula kiato, no kula kai usukti kene wa tukte tu ungalo wasa. Sula ungalo kote umbala kiten ala kianto to da besu mo kula. Ela mokola kianta da disa mokola wa kianta na mi kosha kini kiten asha. We're going to look at grid work system, which is actually working with others. So grid work system with working with others. If you're drawn to a place in a group of people, it usually finds that you'll find that it is in a group of three people. It's quite uncanny, actually, that if you're going somewhere and there are three people, it's usually because that you're actually going because there is a, a grid work system to do because your each pin will hold a space. OK. And as you hold the space, you're creating a, a, a triangle. Okay. Da. Ela kianta da basimo kuluwa sa makiatam, da basimo kuluwa pa kina te disia makiatam. And at this point, when we're actually working in a three, we might be then activating a portal. Okay. So we're looking at activating. So we've talked about the reversals and now we're going to be talking about bringing in a completely new system. The new systems normally work from that of an old portal that is either running or needs a reversal. OK, so you might get a portal that's already up and running. But what we're doing is we're, we're extending into a new system of an amplification of that to ignite within the uh, the grid work system of the earth to amplify and to upgrade the system by being a conduit. We're working with others to bring in um, a new sense of an upgraded version. OK, so it'd be more of a grid work working with others to amplify it. You can also do this singularly, singularly but you're using maybe a tree or a stone, a big rock in the system. So I've done that work before where I've rather than having people with me, I anchor it in the portals using trees around me. But this then brings in this beautiful portal that works here, okay? So these might be then trees instead of people. Or they might be rocks, okay? It depends. It depends if you're working singly or whether you're actually anchoring it into trees as conduits. It doesn't matter or if there are people around you that you're anchoring it in. It just depends on the mission that you're at. But the understanding of that grid work is going to just assist you with understanding what it is that you're actually doing in the first place. Or the or the clarification of what you're doing is absolutely, you know, what, what I'm getting through my experience. So I'm not telling you how to do it. I'm just telling you that these are the possibilities of your own experience, um, um, which is always good to know, isn't it? Uh, you know, from my perspective, this is how it's always worked for me. 
So we're either working with other people, which is others, or other stones. So you can anchor into stones within a triangular system, or others as being trees as conduits. Da. La lia ma koshi ma kieta, sene mi kieton ma kosha. It is all about the anchoring of light. Moving the darkness out of the system. That's what grid work's all about ultimately, is the lifting of the grids. Alla gianta da baisimo kosha macchiata, alla gianta da basuko do no lo kaikwe. Solo ko kana in mokola kiata, tesi macchiata na mokola kuesha. Tukin makala kitukin o la kio kolakiana agada badagana makai o kosha kodemikito na makosha. So within this system here, we've got a reversal of energy or an activation of energy as it's anchored into a placement here upon the grid. Now, if you actually look at some of the videos that I did, which is about light language, that brings in a sense of light language that goes through into a grid work system. Um, and I did this sort of um, thing so that you've got grids coming across here. Uh, light codes, okay, is sort of anchoring into the whole system of template work. So you might be doing um, some template work which is anchoring in to a system here and then upgrading the whole template. So you might have actually gone to a location and find yourself here, 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 here. You might be doing a wider grid work, so you might go down to Land's End and then up to Glastonbury and then you're then going to London then you're going to back to where I'm at here in um, East Sussex so you might find yourself actually pinpointing yourself working out a grid work system here going into another place here when you're directed within your mission to here and then you then anchor it down into here and then you find yourself then anchoring it in here it depends on the mission itself as well but the understanding of that when you're taken to different locations there's always a reason why you need to be there to anchor it in so that you can claim it later on for where you're at because if you've not been to a location then you cannot anchor into where you've not been okay if i'm going to anchor in to um this is about physicality by the way so not about doing upper grid work system which is a completely different subject which we will talk about in the next video but that on the boots ground you have to have been there to anchor the light into that place or the person that you're with that needs to have been there for the attraction or the connection to that place with boots on ground, right? So we're looking at that rather than the high perspective. Okay, thank you. Ala giana da basimo kola bi chun chuk chane kwa la kiten a la kaba pasimo kola kiatam. Ela gianta da basimo kola kian kola basio bakina makiatam. You might, might find yourself bringing forward crystals, you might find that you're bringing stones, um, rocks, um, something that's creating a little grid on the ground, you might want to create a little invoking fire, you might start to use elements of water, um, all of that within a grid work um, activation, anchoring in light will always bring that in. You might also find that it'd be just like a, literally like a minute. OK, or it might be just a long process of half an hour or so, you know, the, the linear time within it really isn't, you know, it's just neither here nor there. You do to how far it needs to be. When I did a um, I went on a trip with some friends, went down to Glastonbury, went through Stonehenge and anchored in light at Stonehenge to Avebury. Then we then came back to Stonehenge. And we uh, or we went to another location, which is um, um, Avebury, Avebury, Stonehenge and Glastonbury. And we did a triangle and then we then had to complete the triangle by going back to Stonehenge on the way back home. And that, again, was a grid work system that over three, four days worth of travel. So it's, you know, so it might be prolonged for the whole trip on the mission. And again, you'll be breadcrumbed along the journey of where you need to be in that now moment. So boots on ground, they can work through you. The galactics can assist um, 
uh, with working the grids upon the earth. Okay, I do hope that this video has served you well in understanding that sometimes you are taken to locations and you don't know why you've been there or why, but because you've been there, you can anchor it in with your foresight, with your insight, shall I say, into um, creating a, a grid work system upon the earth of feet on the ground. Okay, thank you very much for joining me on this playlist. I'm going to go in and look at a higher perspective on grid work systems. And so please join me on that video. Check out all the other playlists as well as the distorted field and all the other playlists that I have. That as I learn and grow, I'm just going to just project that understanding from my perspective okay it's from my perspective if this feels wrong to you it's okay everybody will have a different piece of the jigsaw puzzle this is how i work and have worked so um thank you very much for joining me please hit that notification bell if you want to understand where uh, these videos are going to come in so that you're notified like and subscribe and all that beautiful stuff okay see you all soon